Hi guys and welcome back to Midnight Who Blog. I'm Patrick and you may notice that I'm outside today which is a very uncommon occurrence for me. Um, but we, it was a reasonably nice day with uh, not a whole lot of clouds. They are starting to move in however so I'm getting ready to go back in. But we, a few of us came out and were shooting and it led me to realize that uh, it's been too long since I've practiced uh, shooting because my aim sucks. Uh, so this wall back here is what we were, what we had our targets against. I left the one that I, the one that I was going after that I hit. Um, set the rest back so we can use them again another day and not leave them down here in the creek. Um, but you, you may notice that there's quite a bit of bullet holes in and around this spot. And it didn't quite hit where I was aiming for. I was aiming for the center of it and I hit, I barely clipped the side. Um, I got some of my old targets in my safe just because that's where I ended up putting them. Uh, that I used to be a much better shot. Got a, uh, playing card. Uh, from a local casino, and when they decommission the cards, they punch holes through the entire deck. And I just barely clipped the inside of the of the hole through the center of the deck, so I thought that was kind of cool, so I saved that one. Uh, two liter bottle caps, which are about half the, uh, oh hey, I got a dollar. <laughs> about half the uh, width of this one, so they're like that thick. And I was able to uh, shoot directly through the center of that one was a bit of a different circumstance, however, because I was using a rifle that time, and this time I was using a uh, handgun. But, uh, anyway. So, this video hopefully won't be late, because it's Friday today, and this goes up at 7. But I still gotta get back inside and actually upload it. So, yeah, it should be good. It's only 310. But, on the way back, I think I would... Uh, Look, because I've been down this creek quite a few times, and I know way off that way. Uh, I know exactly where a few interesting things are in the creek that are put there to prevent erosion. Um, but there should be one still over in this area, so I'm going to go see if I can look real quick, see if I can find it. Because uh, a long time ago, someone buried vehicles into the edge of the creek bed. So, I remember the last time I came out here I was able to find one. Sorry for the traffic. I kind of live right off the highway. But, we shall see if I can find it. I think it was pretty quiet traffic. Uh, well, So the, the thing I remember I did just find, I think, unless it's in the bushes now, um, so let's take a quick look here and see that, look down here, there's bits of metal, there's, will look like parts of a frame or something, maybe an older bit. Could be a piece of machinery, but I, I was told originally it was a car that they had buried. And there's actually a little bit more metal here where I was standing. So I'm standing on top of something that's buried as metal. And further down the creek a ways, uh, I know for a fact that there's at least two vehicles there, one of which still has some of the upholstery left in it. So... Anyway, I just thought it was kind of interesting. I figured it would be a... Quiet! <laughs> I really like outside, which is odd considering I'm always inside. Um, I just don't like inclement weather, which is what we're getting a lot of lately. So, I'm gonna head back inside and edit this and send it to the YouTubes. All right, so, uh, forgot where I was exactly on the property and uh, 
that's a bunch of uh, blackberry bushes that I really don't want to go through, so I'm going to have to find my way around. So. Yeah, lovely. All right, so I'm nearly nearly back to my house, so I'm going to go ahead and end this here. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, if you want to see more, I'll put a bubble to subscribe in the bottom right and a link to one of my past videos in the top right or maybe left I don't know I'm looking at a viewfinder it's mirrored anyway thanks for watching bye